guys, it's Jen. I am here today to show you a little Hobby Lobby haul. As many of you know, I love Hobby Lobby. Um, I could spend hours in there at one time and be completely fine with it. Um, I have been doing, <laughs> say hi Colton, I have a little helper here today. Colton is here and he's probably gonna be into everything and loud, so hopefully we'll be able to get through this. Um, we just moved into our new home not long ago and it's gonna be a long process of decorating. Um, so it's just gonna be a little bit here and there and I have purchased some things before we moved into the house from Hobby Lobby and I'm not including those in this video, um, but I might show them you know, in some other videos later. <laughs> okay, you have to stay back from the camera. Um, so let's just go ahead and jump right into it. So I'm trying to get things to decorate the new house. It's gonna be kind of a long process of finding what I want and where I want to put things and just the whole decorating process. So it's gonna be kind of slow going, um, but I did pick up just a few things here and there. Um, so last night we went to Hobby Lobby, Kaylin and I, it was just the girls. So we spent quite a bit of time in some couple of the things she got, she just kind of put in for, so a couple random little things for her. Um, we do have quite a bit of stuff from Hobby Lobby for her room that maybe I'll show like in just a little room tour for her and show you those things. Um, Colton. Um, so anyways, let's just go ahead and I will show you what I've got. When I am shopping at Hobby Lobby, I try to unless there's something that I really need for something. I try to only get the things that are on sale for that week, or if there's like one bigger thing, then I use the 40% off coupon. Okay, first thing, I got these two things on a trip a while back, but I just grabbed them um, because some of the floral stuff will be going in them. Um, but I got this ceramic vase when um, this stuff was 50% off, and it's originally $39.99, so I probably paid $19.99 for it. Um, but it has the little crackle design up here, if you can see that in the camera. Um, a gray strip right here, and then like a sandy kind of fill on the bottom. So that's pretty big. I currently have this on my mantle. I don't know where everything is really going to go and stay, but um, I just love the colors and look of this. So this is one thing. Um, this is another. I already took the price tag off of this, so I don't remember how much this was, but I do remember that I got it 50% um, off. Just a galvanized metal vase with brown straps on the side. And I have this currently in our powder bathroom that I will maybe show you once I get that all decorated. Um, so that's one of the things. And last night I picked up this galvanized metal thing that hangs. It's got um, a jute rope here, the little decor. Y'all, the struggle's real trying to make this video with um, Colton here. Um, this was in the spring shop and I believe this was 40 or 50% off, but the regular price is $19.99. And this will hang in my entryway. I haven't hung the hooks on the wall yet, but I have a, um, a bench and I have hooks that will be hanging above that. So this will be hanging on the wall with some flowers or greenery hanging out of that for decoration. A couple things Kaylin put in for um, that were on super clearance, so I got them for her. Um, these two things are for her fairy garden, which we need to redo. Um, but this was originally $5.99. It was on clearance for $1.50. It's just a little swing for her fairy garden. And then also for her fairy garden is a little birdhouse, <laughs> Colton. It's a little birdhouse that sticks in her fairy garden. It was, it's originally $2.99 and it was on sale for 75 cents. I got this little basket. Um, last night the baskets and things like that were not on sale so I used my 40% off coupon on this but it is regularly priced $8.99. And I love this basket, I love the look of it. Now my thought is for this, I need something to keep on the counter with our, our salt and, 
here are um, salt and pepper shakers for napkins. And I wanted something just kind of short and rectangular that I could put napkins and the little salt and pepper caddy in. But I couldn't find anything like that, so I don't know if I will continue to use this to hold the napkins. But I do have them. Um, I will have it just kind of sitting separate with the napkins in that. And he's going to show that to you, too. Um, you can take that, buddy. Go take it. Go put your car in it. You go put your car in it. And another thing, it's not really decor related, but um, they have these in the um, spring shop. It's just little plastic totes. Um, these are $4.99 each, uh, but I believe they were, they might have been 40% off. They could have been 50% off. Um, but I like to have these in our camper to tote things back and forth for whatever activity we're doing or um, we camp at Fort Wilderness at Disney World a lot and sometimes <laughs> we will use um, the bathhouse there, the facilities, because they're the nicest there, they're, they're just really nice. These are good to put your towel in, your you know bath essentials and just run to the bathhouse real quick. So. That's what I got these two for, just to keep in the camper. I saw this and I thought it was just adorable. This is a um, a plant stand. It has a little pot right here and it's not sitting straight because it's zip tied on at the bottom. This was 50% off, it's regularly $39.99 and I got it for $20. It was on clearance, not just a regular sale. Um, but it's got a black base here and a pot up top. I'm not kind of sure what kind of plant I will put in it or where exactly I'll put it in the house. Um, but it sits, it's sitting next to me and it's like this tall. So I don't know if you can really tell size wise, but I just thought that was super cute. So there's that. And I'll go ahead and get into the um, flower plant, plant greenery kind of stuff. I got this little floral ball. These were not on sale, but it was $3.99. Just a little boxwood ball that I'll probably put like on a candle base stick thing somewhere. Um, these, all of these um, floral picks were 50% off. Um, so I got this one and I might put this in this one when I hang it, I'm not sure. Um, but this one was $7.99, so it was $4. This one, Kaylin put in to get for her room. It was $5.99, so we got that for $3. Oh, here's another one that she snuck in there. Just a little violet rose, and it was $1.99, so we got it for $1. Um, and then we got these, these were $3.99 each, so $2 each for these, and this one, how much was this one, $3.99, so $2 for this one, and watch out bud, you're going to fall, and these, which are just super cute, um, were $4.99 each, so $2.50 um, each, and they're just really nice and simple like green and then a little something I think I'm going to put them in this I need to trim them down but I think I'm going to put them in that in the um the powder bath and that'll be super cute um but that's all for the greenery wise and that's almost it I just have a couple um of planner things um so these are just completely random here but I needed a new planner. I didn't have one for this year. I haven't really been in a great routine with using a planner. I've had them in the past and it's hit or miss whether I really get into it and do it or not. And I think it's because I was just trying to do it too overboard with stickers and decorating and doing all this and that, which I don't have time to do. I'm not as functional in that. So it's just gonna be basic with what I do with the planner now. And I found a super good deal on a planner. It is the Happy Planner, and I've had a couple of these before, and I like them pretty good. Um, but I found this one. It's not the 18 month, it's just a 12 month. I already took this off. Hey bud. Um, 
but it's the um, Happy Planner by, um, it's the yeah, Great 365 bye, bye, bye. Happy Planner by me and my big ideas. I'm sure that many of you have heard of it. This is originally $24.99, and I found it in the clearance area for $6.25. Can't beat it, especially since I needed one of these. I went and looked in the regular planner area for these, and they were, all the um, Happy Planner stuff was 30% off. Um, but I still didn't want to even want to pay that much. 30% off of $24.99. I really didn't even want to pay that much. Um, so you cannot beat a $6.25 planner. Um, so this is the front. It says 2018. It's got navy stripes, the floral print, the back, and it's just got your monthly layouts here, and then your vertical um, monthly layouts. So that's, I, I, I was super, super, super excited about this find. And I got a couple little planner accessories. This is by the Paper Studio. All the Paper Studio items were 50% off. So this was originally $9.99, so I got it for $4.99. Um, it is 819 stickers. But it's just basic things. Like I mentioned, I'm not really good with all the kind of sticker kind of things, but these are just kind of like a lot of checklist stickers, which is the main reason that I got it. And then just kind of basic thing, it's got some foil. So I thought those were really cute. They kind of match with the colors here of this particular planner that I found, um, which again, I'm really excited about. And then I grabbed these. I already took them out of the package, but they were $4.99, 30% off. They are the Happy Planner stencils for the classic size planner that I have. And there's a picture of them. I already took them out of the package and was trying them out. But they could be like a little bookmark. Let me put it in here. It's clear, so it's hard to see. Um, but it can be, it just clips in here. It can be a little page marker but it's a stencil where you can do a little check mark thing and then it has a line. And I was just playing around with it, it came with two. One has a square checkbox and the other one is a circle checkbox. Um, but I don't, I don't know, I just kinda like the ideas for these cause I like to write, kinda like to write on the lines. And I write a lot of lists, check things off of my to-do list, etc. And I was just kind of playing around with it. I need to figure out what kind of pen. But it just makes, you know, just a little something that fits right into these boxes. So that was cool. Stay tuned for more home decorating things and hauls and all kinds of stuff. And I will try to maybe film these videos when he's napping. But when he's napping, I have Easton home. And right now he's at school. So that's it for now. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye.